What's up, y'all? It's your girl Tyra, and thank you for joining me at Beauties and Her. So today I will be installing this beautiful Bob 10-inch wig that I got from guess where? Amazon. Literally, when I was in high school, I used to get all my wigs from Amazon when I first started out doing my own hair. And today we're back with Amazon because I found out about AliExpress. But we're not talking about AliExpress today, we're talking about Amazon. So I got this away from Amazon, like I said, and the vendor is Ali Pearl. And it came with this pamphlet to show you like how to take care of the wig, the do's and don'ts. And it also came with an elastic band, and it also came with a wig cap. Let me see what the wig cap is. It also came with this wig cap, and I'll be showing you how I installed this wig. And let's get into the video. So as you can see, I already did my foundation braids and I'll be using the Balm Goo to slick all my hair back. And also, if y'all could drop in the comments y'all favorite face products to use because when I was recording this video my face was just going through it like it was looking so bad I mean it don't look like this no more I got it cleared up for the most part but if y'all can help your girl out please I beg And after I do that, I'll be using my blow dryer to seal in the gel and push it back and make it hard for it to be easier. And now I'll be putting on my wig cap. Now I'll be putting on the wig and sizing it to my head, making sure that it is in front of my hairline when it's time to apply the glue. And also, I don't know if y'all can see, but I have a low hairline. So sometimes it can be harder to get the lace over my hairline, but we did it today. First, I'll be cutting the sides of the ear tabs and making sure that it fits around my ears so it won't be uncomfortable and it would just lay properly. The ear tabs could be so annoying, like, oh my gosh. Literally. Then after I finish fitting the ear tabs behind my ears, I will go in with my scissors and cut the lace around my hair. I like cutting the lace first while it's on my head instead of doing it like just off like freehand because it's so much easier. You can see where everything's gonna be. You can cut the lace as short as you want and it's just way easier than doing it freehand, not on your head. And as you can see, I'm trying to get as close as I can to the hair. Mm -hmm. 
and also try not to cut in a straight line try to make some wigglies and squigglies to make it a little more rigid i think that's what i want to use but yes just make sure you're not cutting in a straight line Now I'll be using my lace glue and putting little dots all around my head. I will let you know at the bottom of the video the name of the lace glue that I would that I am using in this video. Now I'm smoothing the glue across my forehead and the trick is for your lace fronts is to make the glue the width of the glue like make it a good amount like make it long make the width of the glue long for it can really be attached to the lace you don't want a you don't want a small you don't want a small width if I'm explaining that correctly as you can see it's very long it's not just a little bit now I'm making sure I'm putting it all over the top of my head and then I'll be using my blow dryer until it gets clear. And I will be doing this in sections. So first I'd be doing the front, then I will get to the sides. And you keep blow drying until it gets clear. second layer on top of that first layer that you did and you'll do the same process by blow drying it Now I am attaching the lace to the front and I'm making sure I am pressing it against my head. I do that I will get my elastic band and I will lay that on my head and let it sit for about 10 minutes sure that I'm blow drying over the elastic band as well. Now I'll be moving on by doing the sides of my hair and it's the same process. I'm going to put the glue on, then I'm going to smooth it out and then I will be putting the elastic band on.
will just be repeating the same steps. Now once that's finished, I will be using some makeup and putting it around the edges of my hair for it can blend out with my skin. And all the information of the products I'll be using will be in the description box below. Once I finish putting on the makeup, I will be using my pomade stick and going section by section with my hot comb and laying down my hair. the video if you have any comments questions or concerns please let me know i reply and answer to all my comments really really quickly and y'all don't this bob give like business room on the go like i'm gonna run like i stuck the hand like i'm messing with this bob and look at the ladies i show you everything up close yeah. and thank you for joining me your girl tyra beauty center i am 